I forgot to turn my mic on. And that's all right. <sighs> because uh, it's been, I think, almost a month or something. It's been almost a month. <laughs> yeah, I lost my mo voice in America. No. Um, you know, funny enough, when I went to America, I went to go visit all my friends. And all of them got sick. <laughs> I think all the ones I visited got sick. Ligo Bun, thank you for the resub. A kid a dance. Hi, how is it? How's it going? I'm sorry. Akarad six dance. 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 I'm sorry I didn't get to see you. Um, yeah, I asked if anybody wanted to hang out, and I can. <laughs> they didn't tell me anything, so I don't know. But you know, I I would have loved to see you. <clears throat> Um, yeah, it's been, how long has it been since I last streamed? I think it says 21 days ago, 23 days ago. Yeah, so my last stream was 23 days ago. And then the one before that was another 23 days. So it's been like a month and a half. Cause like that stream didn't count. That stream kind of, okay, it didn't count. I like that. Whose is that? Oh, Jaxers. Wait. Did, he, did Ojaxer just rep that from somebody? Like, off the game? I need this. <laughs> Speaking of which, I kind of need more emotes. I need, I need more emotes. There's a couple things. <clears throat> so, I don't know if, well, do I want to tell this? Do I want to or not? <laughs> well, I guess it's fine. So I quit my job, guys. <laughs> um, I quit my job. I have two months left before I have to skedaddle out of the country and move out you can use oh you can fo use follower remotes eat outside of channels now amazing that means i can use it hold on does that mean i can use it why am i not why won't let me do it i want to use them anyways yeah i quit my job um, my IRL job as <laughs> IRL barista, but don't worry, VTuber barista is still here. Um, but uh, that means that I actually have to put focus on to, I don't have to, but I want to. I'm put more focus on streaming. And in the meantime, while I'm waiting for all the paperwork to get processed for me to skedaddle out of the country, uh, that means that I can just, I can just, you know, do whatever in the meantime. And for a lot of that time, it's going to be working on like music stuff, editing for other people, editing for myself, doing all that kind of stuff. <laughs> Akira Shrek can breach containment. I don't think it should go there, but that's fine. <laughs> Booba. Oh, unfortunately, Booba will never, will never reach, uh, decontainment i guess <sighs> so there's a couple things that i want to do in these two months um i want to do one thing add more emotes thank you for the resub thank you for the 33 months thank you so yeah i want to add more emotes I want to get more emotes. I think I have like three more slots I can fill. I can, so I have two more standard emote slots that I can get for free. So, and then, yeah. And then two more tier one and one more animated one. And I have a tier three that's open, but I don't think anybody is going to get that. So like, I don't, that's fine. That one can just be left untouched. So yeah, I technically have two standard ones and one animated one that I can do. So Milk. my necklace moves. Yeah, it's, it's dangly. It's very, very dangly. I think in my old one it could too, but like... Um, I, I think this one's a lot more noticeable. So yeah. <laughs> Bonesaw, hi Bonesaw. Are you winning, son? Are you winning, son? <sighs> yeah, okay, so no, mm, so more emotes. I want to get my all my slots. <laughs> Fuck, what was that? Holy shit. <laughs> Ow, my ears. Are you guys okay? What? 
You guys okay? <laughs> That's the first time I've ever heard that. I thought I broke something. I thought I broke something. Hold on, let me turn that down a little bit because that was freaking loud. What was that? What was that? Who's <sighs> firing the front lowering gunshot? Okay, I need to find that right now. I, I'm sorry, Gentle Relts, for waking you up. Ah, you're back. Hello, Gen uh, it's the only guy I know. Let's see. Um, was that this one? That's alert box. What's the sound box? Where's the sound box? Is the sound alerts? Okay. That was fucking loud. Okay. I'm gonna turn that down just a little bit more. Okay. All right, so if I'm playing a horror game, you guys know what to like do. Like I'm at my heart. I wish I had a heart rate monitor. That's one thing I kind of want. <laughs> Thank you, Bun. Was that? Was that? I didn't hear the horror. You're fine. You're fine. It's it's great. It's fine. Everything's gonna be okay. All right. Uh, emotes. Yeah, I got two slots, two two follow emote slots, and two standards. One animated. I'm gonna try to get those filled within these next two months. The next thing I want to do is um, upgrade my bit donations. Thank you for the segue, Lego Bun. <laughs> I want to do bit donations for like 25, 50, uh, plus the sound alert ones. The sound alerts ones are always fun. Um, but like 150. Thank you. That's the wrong location, but that's fine. We'll do that again. Bah! Thank you for the 69 bits. Yeah, it's still just the piano sounds, which I guess is okay. But like, let's let, let's make this a little bit more interactive, okay? So actually, I'm gonna write some notes here. I'm gonna open up a, an Excel sheet. You guys like Excel sheets? Okay. Um. Okay, you can do Google Docs, but Google does Google Docs do Oh there, it goes Google Sheets. Oh, who is this? Commission Whoa. Whoa, I whoa, that's weird. Okay, so I just found a cool um spreadsheet saying hey who does live 2d who does rigging who does pixel art who does illustration portraits animations etc etc i can't sorry occupado so that was pretty cool okay that's this is i'm getting distracted again hello brain okay google docs is weird since you have to view a person's doc it is saved to your history and it looks like it's yours well, this is mine now. Okay. Okay. Um, VTuber to-do list. And unfortunately, I still cannot type. I'm going to star that. I'm actually going to open this up in a different window so you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm glad the pegging still works, too. What would this stream be without pegging? Yeah, we gotta. Ha I wonder if we could like enhance the pegging experience. You know, I wonder if like that's a thing we can do. Um, window is it window capture that I'm looking for? That's not what I want. Room. 
There's a brief period pegging also. Yeah, that was, I remember that. Where pegging also pegged me. That was pretty fun, honestly. Okay, there we go. I'm just doing some things here. Wow, look at that. You can't fucking see any of that. Let's um try to condense this even more. How's that? Does that look good? <laughs> I can't even see what that looks like. A nice little spreadsheet though. Yeah, it sure it sure is white. I feel like that shouldn't be a permanent peg feature just to sometime. Oh, um, I mean, I wonder if there can be like a, you know, like you know, you know how um in in like certain games there's like a, a like if you reach burst, you can like you can just like tap the screen or like mash a button and you get a tons and tons of oh hi doggy, tons of points. I wonder if there's like a, a thing where like. You, I could activate burst, and then people could like throw as many things by typing in one thing. I wonder if that could be like a thing. Abe Taro, hey, welcome. We're talking about things that I want to do to improve the stream. Okay. Um, what do I want to? How do I want to format this? Okay. I'm not an Excel master. So we'll just do things by you. You know what? I don't like doing by the corner. I just don't like doing that. So we're just going to clear that off like this. I always like a good old margin. And then we'll consolidate. Nice. Nice. <clears throat> I'm in a call talking about high on life while we riff on the game itself. Is that a good is that a good game? <laughs> Clearly not. There's a lot of niche internet personalities showing up there, like PewDiePie probably. You know there's a there's a game called YouTuber Life and it has like off I think PewDiePie's actually in in the game. But like there are some there are some personalities like that's clearly this other person but like you know it's but oh is that the way is that the game with the gun is that the game with the gun i don't even know why i'm doing like a, a thing like this um add-ons to Twitch. Yeah, and now we're gonna color it purple, cause we can. Purple. That makes it so fucking hard to read. <laughs> Let's make that a little bit lighter. There we go. Yeah, I was looking at that game and like, here's the thing. I, I, I do my impression of Justin Roiland and his comedy. His comedy, his, his humor is Hey, it's me, awkward guy. I'm gonna repeat the same things over and over again, so things aren't as awkward. But like, it's funny because it's awkward. <laughs> so here's the joke again. I'm gonna repeat it again, and 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 I'm gonna go through every avenue of outcome because it's funny to think about the things uh, that are in a, a conversational piece. <laughs> that's that's the humor. It's funny. You like it? Luckily, you kind of start tuning at some of that shit. <laughs> there's a there's a scene in that game where there's two guys just saying fuck you over and over again. They're like, fuck you, no, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. 
It dies down to give other characters a chance to talk. I mean, maybe maybe that's good. Okay, what about emotes? And I can just I can just add stuff as I go down too. So um, we're gonna go emotes, and then we're gonna go. You know, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna graph this all of it. Full graph. There we go. I kinda don't like that, but we'll we'll live with it. We can organize it by color. It's a very mid game. You find people like Joe Parrot in there, which is fun. Guest appearances are always fun. That's why I like collabing with people. Okay, and then alert sounds. Um, what else did I want to do? Maybe extra features like pegging, like advanced pegging. I don't even know I have all this space here. I guess this would be notes. Is there a way I can like combine all these, but like not combine all of these like that? There's gotta be a way. <laughs> advanced pegging. Now nah, that's what we need. We need advanced pegging. In fact, we're gonna add it right here. Advanced pegging. I wonder if you can, there's a ways to organize this. But you know what, I'm not a, I'm not an Excel master, so we're just gonna, we're just gonna live with whatever I can come up with. I wonder what other emotes I can have. I guess I can, don't even need to, con shit. I don't even need to consolidate this. I can just make this longer. <laughs> and this will be, you know what, this will be, this will be, um, notes. Oh, I can just wait, wait. I got an idea. I got an idea. Consolidate these two, and then these can be be like done. Did we implement it? And then notes in case I need to write notes on these things. Yeah, this is looking like a spreadsheet. I think the follower emotes outside of the channel chat may apply if you're subscribed. Oh, okay. I think that that would make sense. I can't be subscribed to myself, but even though I am. All right, guys, you know what to do. Subscribe to me. Peg people. Uh, we need a peg emote. We need like an official peg emote. And spread the word of Sh uh, Shrek Hira. Alert sounds. I don't know. Ow! Bicycle. <laughs> and I can add. Can you add row or a row below? Can you do a row below? A row below. Yeah, it doesn't copy the emote though. See, I'm probably doing this in the most inefficient way possible, but let's go. What would a Peggy emote even look like? There's one on my like on my Discord. I don't think it's very good. I'll just leave this down here just in case. We'll just um, we'll just crop it a little, make it look a little bit nice, make it real hot, a soup or a dip. We call it heat and sip. And if something comes up, we can just add to the list. Okay. Oh Jesus.
Do I want to like add some like extra music or anything? I think what I have now is okay. Maybe something similar but drawn instead. Yeah, you know what? Let's let's drawn instead <laughs> or illustrated. Illustrated. Pegs Illustrated. That's like a new like a new magazine coming out. Like like Sports Illustrated, but it's Pegs Illustrated. All the pegs directly to you. Hmm. Here's the thing. <clears throat> I have like really, really bad sense of branding. <laughs> Other than the barista thing, I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing with my channel. And uh, I don't know if you guys can tell over the last year, but I just kind of been like going with the flow and just doing whatever. But like it lacks interactivity, I think. And I think that's the thing that I want to add a little bit more is add some good old interactivity to the channel. Where's the coffee bean emote? Why would you need a coffee bean emote? Like, what would you need it for? Like, like, hey, so so not only do we need like a reason for one, but like I, I feel like you guys have to use it. Got a bean put? What's what? Bean post. Get beaned on? I'm surprised you can't throw beans at me, actually, guys. You know what? Advanced features. Throwing beans. You can guys throw beans at me. <laughs> so I could just I could just add that to like um, to to tits. I can add that to tits, and then you guys can throw beans at me instead of throwing at whatever that is. It's a heart. Ah, it's a hole. Ah, it's a bike. Wait, I feel like the hole is underutilized, you know? We can, like, we can make the hole more utilized. I don't know. <laughs> I do I do think it's kind of sad that it's kind of locked behind, a, like, a a bit thing. Like, you have to donate bits to get to my hole, but I think, I think that's, um... I think that's kind of like a fun little thing. You want my hole? You want my hole? You gotta pay for my hole, guys. I think that's um, the best part. Take care of looking down the hole. I think the, the hole reveal emote as it is is fine. <clears throat> I just think I just need, I don't know. Here's the thing, I'm not more, I'm not much of an emote person, so I don't really use emotes unless it's like, Aha! Specific gentle relts. Thank you for throwing a bear at me and my hole and whatever else was in there that I didn't see. Hmm. And I just, I really like holes. No, I don't. I'm just here. We're just hanging out. We can talk about like what I was doing for the past month and a half. Um, so yeah, I quit my job guys by the way what happened to you guys in the last year and a, or month and a half did i say year and a half i meant month and a half because um my whole year has been crazy a lot of things have happened in the last year you know it's coming it's coming to the time where like we're doing like the new year's things guys i turned 24 <gasps> that's a good number honestly 24 okay seriously 24 through like 20 23 to 25 is like the ideal age to exist honestly because like that's when like you're like peak performance i'm 37 tm trademark and i'm like freaking have rickety bones and I, I can't do the same things i can't stay up as late as i want to and if i do it's it's usually anxiety filled which i'm pretty sure can happen at 23 to 25 but like it's even worse when you're older i'm not peak performance at all I have monster energy. That's how I supplement my my life. Oh, so you get about being an adult and being adult like and doing things. I actually did some meal prep today for the like first time in like years because I would have a job, be too tired to cook after I finished my job. So I would just grab Subway on my way home. Or whatever was available, McDonald's, Subway, this burrito place that I worked by. <clears throat> but, you know, 
I did some meal prep. I marinated some beef. And that's probably the least amount of meal prep that I could possibly do. But heck, it's still meal prep and it still counts and I'm still an adult. Congratulations, me. I am an adult. <laughs> yeah, I kind of feel kind of accomplished for that. Not gonna lie. I think the, the idea of not going to work and not being exhausted is so appealing to me, but now I have to focus on this being my job for the next two months. So like, whatever. I went to the bank to deal with inheritance. To, oh, jeez. That is important. Yeah. Congratulations. We are all adults here, I think. 18 plus. If you're, if you're not 18 plus, get out of my stream. It's marked for 18 plus. I'm just thinking. I'm thinking. I, I, I sold stocks today. So I got... I had some stocks that I was, like, kind of holding on to. That was a weird feeling, selling stocks. It's a weird feeling buying stocks. It's a weird feeling selling stocks. <laughs> if you're under 18, you're too... <laughs> what is this, a bar? <laughs> we were a bar cat. I mean, some people are into that, but, like, that's not... You know, I don't ever... I don't understand the, the appeal of having an 18 plus cafe coffee cafe you know i feel like i know like if you're an adult and you drink coffee that's sort of like the appeal but like i feel like it should be accessible to younger people as well but like you know because like young minds they think about a lot of things a lot of things that old farts like us can't think about in fact they all have faster brain processes and they are addicted to the TikTok and the social media. So I, I just figured out a couple things about social media nowadays. So like, you know, you know, uh, the idea of growth is good to investors and stuff. And that's why a lot of, uh, a lot of, <laughs> a lot of companies focus on growth and development rather than making, you know, things comfortable you know they're okay like people aren't okay with with plateauing results and we're at a point in life where sometimes sometimes we can't grow because there's just no more room to grow you know and i was thinking like that's like you know growth <laughs> growth is what all companies strive for even social media companies like Twitter and Facebook and stuff like that and so their form of growth is getting new users onto the site or users to use their 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 social media and for things like TikTok that's kind of you know like instead of growing with numbers now with people using their 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 services or their their whatever their social media their growth is in time accumulated per user now so like it's how much time you spend on their platforms is their is their growth because they don't need any more people they got all the people they need now and they can't seem to get any more people because everyone's fucking using their on their things and so they said like well Let's take more from the people who are already here. And so, like, it's... You, 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 you get the time. How much time can we get them to invest in our, into our site? They renovated the bank I go to and turned it, the interior into a ge gentrified hipster... What? <gasps> you know, that is a thing! You know, that is a thing that's happening with banks. I don't know... Okay, well, I do know why. Um, it has to do with time again. They're not looking for people anymore. They already have enough people. They're looking for time. And that's why a lot of banks are actually doing this. I, I, I didn't know this until like a couple of weeks ago, actually. But there are banks that are turning a lot of their stuff into cafes. They're, they're like, uh, they're, they're 
like lobby areas and stuff. And the reason is because now they are looking into what's called the third place. And this is actually what Starbucks, it was striving to have. And I guess other companies have started to pick up on this third place idea. So there are three places that you go to guys in your life. There is home, there is work if you have a job. And if you don't work from home and the third place, which is a place where you can go that is not home or work. And for a lot of people, it's like Starbucks, it's the mall, it's um, whatever, wherever they want to spend their freaking time, you know? And the what banks are trying to do is create a place where people can do their like banking and like their their money stuff because you know I'm really good with money and they just sit down at the cafe they do their banking stuff they sit at the cafe and then they are just bombarded with branding and then and that place becomes their third place you know why people love Starbucks so much it because it's so familiar to them you can go anywhere the fuck you want there's a Starbucks down the corner down by the corner and every Starbucks is pretty much the same. So like once you get accustomed to one Starbucks, you can go to any Starbucks and it's just, it's just a third place. And that's what Starbucks is trying to like get. They're trying to get people, they're in they're getting on people's time. They were ahead of there. They were ahead of the curve. They already knew what they were gonna get. The third place, third place. And I can't stop getting third place in fucking Mario Kart. Yeah, I don't care for Starbucks. I'm sure lots of people do though, but yeah, if you don't care for Starbucks, they didn't get to you. And that's probably a good thing because their drinks are fucking expensive. What would be last place? Death. <laughs> Your last place is at this six feet underground. Get in, loser. <clears throat> I gotta stop sipping my monster. Energy drinks are so bad for you. My room is getting so hot. Manakadobo! Congratulations on first. Hi, hi, welcome back. I was, um... I was at the, uh, this grocery store to get today buying a bunch of, um, food stuff. And I saw adobo sauce just sitting on the shelf in the, um, in the international food aisle. And I can... I could talk more about the international foods aisle, but let's not get into that just now. When are they going to gentrify their funeral parlors and install a cafe? You know, everything is going to be everything is going to be bars and cafes by 20, 2032. 2032, there's going to be uh, a cafe in every building, even your own home. They're going to put me out of a business. What else do I got to do? I'm just a pure purebred cafe. In fact, I don't know, I guess it's technically a bakery. Cafes are also part bakery, so like a bakery slash cafe. Five cents per bottle sold. Ooh. That's a lot of bottles. And that's a lot of waste. You can recycle that bottle and get five cents. Wait, is that how you get five bottles? Five cents per bottle? You just go in the person's house, you steal the bottle back, and you sell it to the recycling plant? And that's how that's how recycling works, right? That's how like recycling, it's like a deposit. Like, you know when you when you when you buy a bottled item, there's a like and they call it a, de a bottle deposit, a recycling deposit. They're expecting you to recycle it. Then you get that 10 cents back and they call it like a they call it a deposit because you can you can get it back as long as you recycle it. But hell, hell knows if you can even recycle it because there's a lot of things that are like, hey, this has touched some fucking food. You can't recycle it. You know, that's the thing. In certain places, if it has touched food or like food service things, you can't recycle it. So um, in my area specifically, if a milk jug has any milk in it, like any milk, it has to be rinsed completely. If it has any milk in it, it is considered non-recyclable and they won't fucking rinse it out. They won't give you that five cents for that fucking jug of milk because you left some fucking milk in it. Isn't that crazy? Welcome back, Prismaya. How you doing? 
<clears throat> what are your what are you guys' favorite sounds? What do you guys like to hear in a stream? I want to add some more bit sounds. You know what? Let's do let's do. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, I already have it. Thank you guys. We gotta add some more sounds. I wanna add the Minecraft. Booba! Why is it mine mine Minecraft hurt sound? Sad trombone? Isn't there a way to like add isn't there a way to like a quick a, a quick key to add below? Sad trombone. Did you update your ch clat ch chat client after messaging me? I sure did. Wah, 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 wah. Is that the sad trombone? I am looking to upgrade my chat, my my streaming experience with you guys, and that's why um that's why I asked you, Prismaya Cool Streamer. It kind of looks like I'm, I'm ordering. You guys are ordering. What do you guys want to order? Hey, what do you want? Hey, I'm at I'm at I'm at Cinnamon Sweet. What you want? I finally had a. Are you guys are you guys familiar with Honey Toast? It's a dessert type thing. Cheese? We don't have cheese. Burger? We don't have burger. I, I guess technically we have cheese. We have cream cheese. I'm holding the D button. <laughs> I got real fucking sick of my chat coming from the bottom. I want my chat coming from the top. Honey cat toast. Miss Honey. Hey, have you broken the news to everybody about Miss Honey? Taco? Could you imagine a place, a coffee place that has tacos? Oh, I went to like a cafe when I was in Chicago. I went to Chicago, guys. I went to a, a cafe or a coffee house. I think that the word was coffee house in Chicago. And they're like, We're, we have one of the best coffees in Chicago. It was actually kind of, it was actually kind of like pretty good coffee, not gonna lie. But it was like, it was not like a cafe coffee. It was like a breakfast house coffee. So I was like, you know what? It's not a cafe, but dang, you guys do have good coffee. So it's not any fancy coffee. It just was fucking good. A cat reveal. Horse racing special. Yes. Make sure you guys are uh, following the, the horse racing tag on Twitch. I kind of want to like make a group, <laughs> a VTuber group called horse racing. And we just use the horse racing tag. I want to like listen. It is like my dream to like have a a VTuber group. I want to be the president of a VTuber group, and I have some ideas, guys. I have some fucking ideas, and it starts with VTubers. It's weird how VTubers became like a like a, a thing that people can monetize. Isn't that isn't that crazy? <laughs> Council president. You know what? If I did have a VTuber group, I wouldn't be the president. I would be the council president. Student council president. You know, I could have been a student council president in high school. I just chose not to. I was so lazy in high school. Ha! <laughs> burger. Hey. Uh, who ordered the burger again? My bank didn't get an actual coffee bar. It's literally just a Keurig on a counter in front of the lobby. I mean, there's cheese on the burger. I like every every bank has like a coffee machine in their in their lobby. I don't know why. I like I'm never in a bank long enough or sitting long enough, you know, to to use one. The only time I ever did when I was waiting for somebody else to to finish their meeting at the bank. So I just had a cup of coffee. Like, I don't know. 
the interior decorating is all the same as a cafe and it's so baffling they are going to cafe gen gentrify your freaking banks uh, this is the way the future guys you know that's they say that starbucks i don't know i'm sorry i like to talk about starbucks a lot but like they they've made some strides in the in the coffee in the coffee world but starbucks um they can consider themselves a bank actually they have enough revenue coming in that they could technically start a bank you know how much money people do for like you know the the app like you know the the apps that you guys have for the the your food um so like mcdonald's has an app taco bell has an app uh, i'm pretty sure burger king probably has an app by now um every food place has an app little caesars has an app and i order from it all the fucking time like every every food place has an app and the first the first company to really utilize the app features was starbucks and one of the things they did was load money onto your app and you can pay using the app and you know lots of companies are doing this now but it is ridiculous on the amount of money that goes into these apps because people will load like fifty dollars a hundred dollars into their app and so that's people's and they already have the money like like it's in-store credit at that point you put the money in you get in-store credit instantly you get copies later you get rewards and like they using the money that they have from everybody <laughs> they're just they're just it's the same thing as getting loans and like and 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 uh and loaning it out and getting interest and stuff like that they're just fucking making money by existing isn't that crazy just by existing just the fact of having an app that just it just rolls in the money to them so they're basically a bank at this point is what i'm saying you guys want to go to the Starbucks bank? Man, I need a, I need a bank. <laughs> I need to be a bank. I want, give me your money, guys. Give me all of it. You know, if it, any, if it were any other place or like any other person or company that's like begging for your money, it's bad. Like if a company begs for your money, wow, how greedy. If it's a bank, wow, how charitable. They're helping you <laughs> store your money. Starbanks. It's okay. If you guys don't, I like, I'm not asking for your guys' money. I'm asking for your time though. Which is more valuable than money? Haha, <laughs> hey guys. You guys spending time with me? Mm. Honestly, time is way more valuable than money. I like spending time with people. It means a lot. And I'm, it means a lot to me that you guys are here, honestly. So thank you. I should do... I should do another subathon. I'm thinking about it now. Since I have the time anyways, I could I could do it. <laughs> I could do a subathon. That's a good idea. Let's do that. Let's not do that. I'll think about it though. Probably, it would probably be after... Ouch. It'll probably be after Christmas. <laughs> Banking. Money. 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 Man, I'm, I'm still thinking about the stocks that I sold the other day. I had to spend the money to get to like to get them anyway so like is it totally a net gain it was a net gain eventually but like was it worth the net putting the money into that i don't even know i'm not really amazing with money i'm just good at saving i think purchases not so much i think that's the sad thing like i don't have any supplement money to like go spend willy-nilly i can't just go buy the latest video games now i have to like actually work towards it I actually have to budget myself. I have to pay for food over video games? Come on, what is this? I am an adult. I'm a fucking adult. I'm gonna drink some coffee, I'll be right back. Not be right back, but just give me a second. There we go. Got my coffee. Are you guys drinking anything today? 
This is tea time after all. If you don't have anything to drink, go get yourself something to drink. Come back in and have some tea with me. I'm having monster energy tea. I had this, um, I, I was in the international foods idol in my store and, and I can talk about this. So I really want to talk about this, but like today is not a day because like I will go on for hours about this, the international food section. But I was in the international food section and they have they have at home boba. You can make your own boba tea at home. And I was like, ooh, I should try this one day. I might do like a like a test stream like, hey, let's do this. Speaking of which, I want to do another mukbang. It's like maybe maybe like a little Caesars. I did I did Taco Bell, but like I was thinking maybe I should do something else like a little caesar's pizza stream where i just eat a little caesar's pizza in front of you guys would that be entertaining i think that'd be pretty fun i finished my drink before stream what did you drink was it water i think you guys should drink more water in fact i should drink more water i do have a water bottle next to me now so that is great orange soda mm. i'm a fan of grape soda Orange soda, cream soda? Soda's just really good, honestly. <clears throat> you know what, there's some, I should like just look in general for just, for, oh, I can't even spell tits. I should just look for just general items to add to tits because i'm still using pretty much all basic items i see people adding like pokeballs they're adding like super mario coins they're adding like cool things and i'm like i'm here using all the basic stuff wow what kind of vtuber are you just doing the bare minimum no 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 this is going to be my this is going to be my retribution this is going to be my my metamorphosis into a pro professional vtuber and not throw dog i think you guys can technically do that <laughs> I wonder if that command is still there. I don't think I don't think I, I think I got rid of that one command. Ooh. Man, I need to I need to like utilize my dog more. Oh hi doggy! We were just talking about you. <laughs> Whoa. Wait a sec. Wait. He just disappeared without teleporting. Is he evolving? Is my dog evolving to a new level? Do you know what the saddest thing about that dog post, by the way, the video file? It does not exist anymore on my computer. So as if something happens, if something happens, to the service that I'm using, I have to recreate that dog post. <laughs> so let's hope nothing bad happens to the to the service that I'm using. I think I don't even know what I'm using for this. I think it's Isaiah Bot. <laughs> so yeah, let's just hope. What did I do for the past? Dude, I'm trying to think about what I did for the past month and a half, and I'm I'm honestly thinking, and I'm like, all I did was suffer and cry. Mika says she has it. Oh, I can you know that that is not even like a. The funny thing is, is that it's not even a true original copy. It is that file is one that I created using that. Using that like um. The file like the the recording. And I recorded it over a green screen. So it's not the true file. It is a copy. It is a counterfeit. So yeah. <laughs> the original is lost. We only have counterfeits. I wish I could like download it from the website again, but no, I can't. It won't let me download it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> There's a couple games that I've been wanting to play since I'm um, coming back. So I want to play Kirby and the Crystal Shards for the Nintendo 64. Yeah, you have a counterfeit dog. Deal with it. Um, yeah, I want to do Kirby 64. I want to do Bayonetta 3. 
Um, I want to do um, that new Dragon Quest game that Minakadobo is playing on stream. Please go check out Minakadobo. How do I? Um, shout out. Please go follow Minakadobo if you haven't already. I have a video of you disappearing in Pokemon. There's a video, um, there's a video of me in, um, Seth's, um, game where I'm helicopter arming. <laughs> I finally got some glitch videos on Pokemon. Oh, but I finished that game, by the way. I got Pokemon Scarlet and I played it during my vacation. I beat it. I'm working on getting the Pokedex filled out. And um, yeah, maybe I'll do that on stream is finishing off the Pokedex. I'm at 80 Pokemon left. Maybe a, bit, a little bit less, but um, yeah. <clears throat> uh, yeah, Bayonetta 3, Kirby, Crystal Shards, Dragon Quest. I still need to pers uh, finish Persona 4. You know what's so funny? I'm at the point where people always stop playing the game. I think Prismaya Cool Streamer, when she was playing Persona 4, also stopped where I stopped. It's after your Shadow Teddy. I'm not sure if Prismaya Cool Streamer finished Persona 4, but that's as far as I remember, is that she also got about this far and then stopped. It's a good stopping point, honestly. It's where you get Risei as your navigator and like it's the second half of the game kind of. So like, wow. She did a while back. Did she actually finish it? Did I like finish it, finish it? I also kind of want to go back and play Persona 5 again. Persona 5 Royal. She did. Oh, she did finish it. Oh, congratulations. I know she, she took a break roughly where I did too. So I got to go do that now. So we have a whole two months for me to finish that game. It was during the very beginning where you're trying to jump that cliff and using your phone to get back up to the cliff. <laughs> yeah, P4 Golden. I do remember that. I do. I think you sent that to me, Gentle Worlds. <laughs> I loved that clip. I think I might have like, I think, did I like, did you post it? Did you post that dog, which was me? Because I'm pretty sure I liked it. Yeah, uh, I want to do Persona 3 Portable for sure. It's in your Discord. Yeah, that's yeah, that's what I thought. I saw it. It was great. I loved it. I framed it. Speaking about picture frames, I finally got my um, my crony birthday stuff. I, I would show you guys, but it has my address on the box that I took a picture of. <laughs> so I can't show you guys unless I censor it. So yeah, that's not happening. But I did get it. I have a, a cool Daki Makara. I have a nice plushie and a framed picture of Crony. The best $200 I've ever spent. Don't look at me. <laughs> okay, now you can look at me. Yeah, I have a pillowcase. The best thing about it is that it's not too sexual. It looks like she's like sleeping on your bed. I don't have a pillow for it. Every place that I look for a pillow for that, for like that pillowcase is too short. The pillows I find are 120 centimeters. The pillow that I, I need is 150 centimeters. So I'm kind of angry. I can't really use my pillow. But when you do set it up, it looks like she's like kind of just laying on your, she's laying on your bed. Honey, hi, welcome. I'm back, baby. I'm back, baby. I'm coming back for you. That's me. I'm not that TikTok, you know. I'm coming back for you, baby. I'm coming back for you. That's me. I came back for you guys. And we're going to have, like, I'm not sure if we're going to stream every day, but, like, I have a lot more free time on my hands than ever before. And it's going to be fucking great. I'm going to spend a whole lot of time with you guys. I'm going to be making covers. I'm going to be making videos. I need to do another Hololive edition video because goddamn every three fucking months I keep doing that. God. 
Every three months, I make a Hololive audition video. Every single time. Every single three months, I always make that Hololive audition video. And one of these days, guys, I'm gonna fucking make it. And I'm gonna say, so like, man, I fucking love getting pegged. And you're like, wait a second, a Hololive member likes getting pegged? Must be Akira. <laughs> Thank you for pegging. I wonder, I, I wonder, like, if I did make it into Hollow Live or like Niji Sanju, because Niji Sanju has auditions every now and then, and they're actually like dated and not rolling auditions. I wonder. Would you guys know? Would you guys know it's me? The funny thing is that like, okay, so I was uh, I was talking to a friend, he works um, at one of the theaters in Chicago, and he he let me meet one of his co-workers, and he's a voice actor. Um, he's not like a, like an anime voice actor, or he, I would say he's a, he's a, he wasn't say he's a voice actor, but he is a voiceover artist. And he, uh, he gets, he like, it, it, this, it's, it's a fairly famous, uh, uh, theater that he works at and the guy who does voices he's got like a nice baritone voice he gets people to be like he like oh we want you to to like recite the vow things like do you take this guy's hand in marriage sort of thing right that's like that he does that voice <laughs> assuming your voice was the same and uh, yeah <laughs> I think I have a pretty re recognizable voice, um, but there are a couple people that have a similar voice to me and have the same like speech patterns. So, like it, it won't be like, like it could be me, but also could not be me. Ah. <laughs> but the yeah, the guy I talked to, he's like, he gave me a bunch of advice. He gave me like a bunch of like he gave me a big pep pep talk too. I wasn't expecting a pep talk honestly. Like yeah, I was. I grew up doing voice stuff like I did voice acting like projects I did fan projects where I like did voiceovers from my favorite cartoons and animes and he was just like get your stuff out there like put passion into if you're ex if you're passionate about this I even told him my name I was like yeah my name is Akira and he's like damn even your name is cool <laughs> I was like damn I'm getting gassed up here so like he's like yeah Get your stuff out there, make it unique, give people what they want first, and then put your spin on it. Like if you're if you're put in for a project like, hey, we need you to do this voice, you go like, okay, you do it the way that you, they want you to do it. And then after everything is done, be like, mm, I think this could be done a little bit differently. I'm gonna try doing my take, is that all right? And if they say yes, then you can start adding your little flares. And like, that's how you get your, like, you know, that's how you kind of get your uniqueness into it, you know, your your personality. Because they are, they're looking for people who look for people to do voices in their project. They are looking for a specific voice. But the moment you add your personality to something, that becomes you. And no longer are they looking for a person to fill this role. They are looking for you. So you want to make it your own. And that's what he said to me. Make it your own. And he said, like, yeah, you have a very unique voice. You have a unique voice. It's got, like, a nice texture to it. I was like, man, this is, this is coming from a dude who has, like, professional voiceover work. And I'm like, hell yeah. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of work that has to be done into it. I think working as a barista, at least a high position barista, made it harder for me to do these kind of things. Because I would come home from work being exhausted and tired but now my work is working on audio stuff so that's exciting and uh, by the way jam kisuke i know jam's not here today but um i'm working on something for jam kisuke right now um I, it was something i was supposed to do months ago actually <laughs> um but we're i'm gonna be working on that and hopefully remixing one of the edits I did for her, one of the songs I did for her. So um, you can look for that. 
as well as hopefully releasing Mogu Mogu and Astro Girl and probably working on some other stuff as well. So you guys can look forward to that as well as like all these cool TikTok stuff. And you know, it's all about making it your own, right? Making your, I really want to redo my, my Kiss Me cover because it does not sound good in a vehicle. <laughs> it sounds good on my headphones. Doesn't sound good inside of a vehicle though. Cause I put it on, I put it on listening. I was like, hmm, I wonder how this sounds like in my vehicle. It sounds like utter ass. So I'm going to remix it. I'm going to redo it. Don't look at my wish list. The girls are, oh, Minaka Dobo is playing um, River City Girls. I was actually playing that um, over the weekend. I want to collab with Minaka Dobo again. I was thinking about asking him to do a portal collab with me. So I was I was going to do that today, actually, but I got distracted. So I'm going to definitely send him a message tonight saying if he wants to play Portal 2 with me. Um, yeah. Make it your own, guys. Make it your own. I'm going to do it. Oh, Jesus. Did you guys hear that? Was that me? Hold on. Uh, was that my, my headphones or was that my mic? Did you hear that? It sounded a little crusty. I'm kind of worried. I heard it. Okay, it's probably my mic then, because I have been having connection issues. Ta, testing, testing, ra. Yeah, okay. It's a connection issue. I will fix it. I have had these. I've had these wires for how long now? Um, I don't know how long is. I guess they're varying ages because I keep adding on to it, but I think my oldest wire here is from 2009. So honestly, not bad. A 12 year, 13 year lifespan for some of these cables. <laughs> and I'm, I'm just getting it. Yeah. Treat your equipment right too, guys. Treat, treat it right. My headphones have seen better days, that's for sure. So treat your equipment right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, I just, I just bought a um, a pen and, and notebook today, actually. I want to try getting into original songs. Um, I don't know if it'll actually go anywhere, but I have some concept ideas that I want to try. So, you guys can hear, you guys can hear. Ooh, that sounds gross. Ah, I don't like that. I'm going to fix that right now. Get out of here. It's just some plastic that's um sitting over top. Out of here. Get out of here. <clears throat> okay. But. But yeah, writing songs is hard. I'm getting a new mic. I'm going to slap it. Like, Are you getting the uh, SM7B? Are you getting the SM7B? Brickleborg. Hi, welcome. Hope you're doing well. I'm not for the SM7B. Honestly, it does sound nice for podcasts, but like... I need a more flexible, I need a more flexible mic. And I, I think if I were to get a new mic, cause I've had this mic for like 14 years now, 13 years now. If I get a new mic, I think I'm gonna get for an AT2020 because that is a really flat and flexible mic and can do things that's just not for, like, you know, it's a pretty even response. And you can even like you can like kind of shape things how you want depending on spacing and stuff. So, yeah, SM7B though, the SM7B, a great, great streaming mic, great per podcast mic, um, especially if you're gonna get loud and dynamic. Oh, I really want the my dream microphone for recording is the C414. It sounds so good on acoustic guitars. I myself 
have a, an acoustic guitar. Oh. Man, I could go off for hours. Hours about microphones and audio equipment. I've got hiccups, kind of. Drinking monster energy was not a good idea. Mm. I kind of want pizza now. You guys, I should order pizza. <laughs> no, 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 I have food at home. I, I gotta, I literally have to be that person that's like, we have food at home. I do not want to be the, we have food at home person. A calzone, oh, you're making it so hard. I have to spend my money wisely, guys. I don't, I'm running on savings right now. And the only thing that gets me money is Twitch subs and, and, and bits. And I don't want to put that on you guys, unless you guys have tons and tons of money. Then other words, uh, that's a different story. Please donate to my Patreon. I don't even have a Patreon, but please donate to it. I think that one of the worst things about me being a streamer is that I'm super comfortable with silence. So like, if we were having a conversation and I just stopped talking, I can literally sit there for five minutes without saying anything because I'm just so comfortable just being in the presence of people. But that's not a good thing for a streamer because like, I gotta be engaging. I mean, I guess you guys could just stare at me for like five minutes. <laughs> it wouldn't be, wouldn't be that entertaining, honestly, but. You know, for maybe for some people it is, you know? Maybe they just need someone to stare at for five minutes. Hey, maybe this is an untapped tar market. What if? What if? But what if? Cow zone. Bone zone. Do not stare at me. You can stare at me. I think... I don't know. I have a, I have a problem with eye contact. I swear, I have like... I, I swear there's something wrong with me socially because I, I cannot do eye contact. Um, I'm like awkward, I repeat myself, I hyper obsess over things. I probably could have ADHD or be on the spectrum, but I don't even freaking know. And it does, honestly, it doesn't even matter because it's not affecting my personal life or my social life, as far as I know, as far as I know. And maybe some other people may be on the spectrum and I'm connecting well with them. I don't know, <laughs> doesn't matter. I like how noticeable it is that my my necklace kind of shakes now with my coffee cup here. It kind of like brings attention to it. I wish I had like an animation of me drinking the coffee. That's like how jiggly my coffee is, by the way. It jiggles. My coffee jiggles. Wiggle, wiggle. A jiggle, jiggle. How about now, Benson? I gotta think about making TikToks again. I am literally three followers away from a thousand on TikTok and that's been the most frustrating thing ever, but also I'm not making anything on it. So like, there's no reason for people to be following me, <laughs> but, but just being so close to a thousand, I'm like, please. Oh, um, I have a new, um, a new uh, social media channel for you guys to follow too. If you guys have Tumblr, a tumblr.com, I have a Tumblr now. Um, that's gonna be used for like, sneak peek stuff and behind the scenes um because like not a lot of whole a lot of people are going to be using it as far as i know but um it's going to be like a like a progress blog so like when i'm working on something you guys can hear it first you guys can see it first and um i think honestly when are you getting a marketable plushie man i i don't think i could be a marketable plushie look at me Look at, I'm not marketable at all, at least not in this form. Is it akiradolce.tumblr.com? Yes, I believe so. akiradolce.tumblr.com. If you have a Tumblr, I have that. And then that's where you're all behind, scenes, behind the scenes stuff and like whenever I post something new. The things you won't see on Twitter or on YouTube. It's literally, it's, it's gonna be a blog. It's just a, this emote is already plus, you know, it is, it kind of is. Should I have my arms crossed like that too? So you can make me like do the kicks. 
I, I, yeah, I, I, I got it like a couple months ago, like a, a month ago. I don't even know how to customize it. How do I even do this? I used to be like amazing at Tumblr. I used to have a crazy blog with crazy stuff in it. It's in the settings. I know it's my blog. <laughs> okay. Um, blog settings. Okay. I kind of customized it. You guys can see my 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 banner. It's just a brick wall. <laughs> Enable a custom theme. Oh, Nahone. Oh, you can see my likes. There's a booby girl on the side. <laughs> How do I make this thing look nice? Maybe I should like more things so I don't have a boob girl on the right side of my, of my thing here. All right, this could be a whole thing I could do. <gasps> a Google Analytics ID. I can send you guys ads. Do you guys like ads, right? Everyone loves ads. Boob cat. Boob cat. Oh my god, HTML? I love HTML. I kind of know how to use this. Anyone who used HTML back in the day? What did you guys use? Wait, was that like cat neo neo cities? Neopets. Neopets, that's the one. Um, there's a website that I used. I don't remember what it's called anymore. I think it's like a Pix, not a Pix of. Fuck. There's like a website where you could share like images and stuff like that and but like you had to do it in html like you had to do it in html i'll do this later i like i like this though i wonder if i can do like a browse themes provenance oh these are these cost money they're fifty dollars i don't have fifty dollars I mean, I do. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to spend it. I was cutting my website today. Your your Neopets website. Just look up user made ones. Free themes. Oh, this one looks nice. Um. I'm looking at catching elephants, but it's not quite. What if I search coffee? Coffee. Black coffee. That looks like ass. I don't want to use that one. Search cafe. Taylor Swift's midnight themes. Does it play? Does it play Taylor Swift on it? Yeah, I'm looking at Tumblr themes right now. You guys can't see it, but... Oh wow, there's one that looks like a... Whoa, there's one that looks like a... Like... Like Windows 95. How can people keep putting Taylor Swift into it? Oh my god. Accessible. You know, I should... Minimal. You know what? Minimal looks really nice. I know people are like, that's that's the thing. This one just looks like a... Whoa. Jesus. Hello. Ah! Uh, you guys hear that? Ah! Uh, <laughs> Krusty! Krusty! Hold on. I'm gonna find... I'm gonna find it. Which one is it? Which one is it? I think I found it. Okay. Ah! Panda! Thank you for the for the raid. Hello everybody, my name's Akira Dolce. I'm having ow, mic problems right now. Welcome to the stream. I am just chatting. I am I am back after like a month of not streaming, so hello everybody. Please excuse my microphone problems. 
How you doing? How you doing? Can we get a shout out? Ow! Dark Vein. Underwhelming man, thank you for the follow. Shout out. Dead by day. Ow! Ah. Dead by daylight. Quit throwing bears in here. Bears are native to Canada. Did you know that? Anyways. I've not played Dead by Daylight, but I get, it makes me freaking nervous to, free, <laughs> to play it. Uh, I'm, I'm really bad at, at having someone chase me. I, I hate being chased. It makes, it's, it's so nerve wracking. Did you win, son? Did you win, Panda? You can add a moose. Oh. <laughs> Caleb, hi, welcome. Panda, thank you for throwing things. Master Shadow, thank you for throwing things. Hey, uh, let me know if you guys want to do some Overwatch. Uh, 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 why do I, I keep doing this? I gotta get new cables, guys. New cables. <laughs> uh, let me know if you guys want to do some Overwatch ranked again, or if you guys want to. Not again, but like, yeah. I think I found the, nope, that's not the one. Is it this one? <gasps> Is it this one? I think I found the one. Nope, that's not it. I'm having my- oh, I know what- I think I know. I found it. <laughs> I found it! Do you guys hear this? I found it. Uh, give me a second here. I'm gonna mute myself real quick and then try to see if I can fix this. Quick, Akira is muted. Send curse TTS messages. Okay, I think I fixed it. For the most part, right? Anyways. Oh, no, yeah, I can still kind of hear it. I gotta get myself a new XLR cable, so that's something I gotta do. <laughs> Helicopter, helicopter, S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S I gotta fix my mic for one minute. Booby booby but 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 pee pee wee wee. For one minute, I'm gone for one minute fixing my mic, and this is what you guys do. Bonesaw wants you to know he has hundreds of hours in Dead by Daylight. Well, tell Bonesaw to carry me in Dead by Daylight. Okay, um, okay, I for need to- For one minute. For one minute. <laughs> I need to, uh, I need to get that on my, um, list of things I need to replace. Funny enough, this is the cable that I, this is the cable that I, um, soldered myself in an electronics Imagine class. Imagine for a moment, carpeted shower. Question mark A. Can we? Can we ban you for that, Emerald Glow? <laughs> Can I VIP you? <laughs> Can I VIP you from that? Get rid of your mod status and just make you a VIP? No, it's fine. It's fine. It's great. It's wonderful. Ugh, a carpeted shower? 
Oh, imagine the mildew on that. Imagine the mildew on that. Okay, I gotta just click off of Tumblr. Sorry. I'm looking at Tumblr and it's distracting me. Do you die of mold? Oh, the mildew. Oh, okay. So I've had like really bad experiences with mildew. Because like, unfortunately, I'm one of those people who like forget about things really, really often. And one of the things that you can forget about really easily is laundry. And um, <laughs> um, mildew sucks. The smell of mildew. Gross. But also, it was like $3 to do your laundry in the apartment building that I was in. I was like, you know what? Maybe the heat will just get rid of the mildew smell. It doesn't. <laughs> it does not. If there was a theoretical carpet that would never get nasty if you leave it in the shower, would you use it in the shower? Yeah, honestly. Um, like, you know, what are those things called? Shower mats? Shower mats get like wet all the time. And a wet shower mat can sometimes feel good on your toes. Just saying, okay? But like, if a shower mat never developed mold or mildew, that would be so great. Like if it was made from some special polyester that like didn't allow mold or mildew to like thrive, absolutely. fucking lootly But like it wouldn't be soft at that point, right, would it? I rewatched that one video, one sentence horror story video where it devolves into everyone saying carpet and bathroom. I think, you know what the funny thing is? There was a house that I stayed at that did have a carpeted bathroom. I don't understand why. They never used it as a bathroom, but there was a like a carpeted room and inside that room, there was a bathtub. And I was like, why is there a bathtub here? And they're like, we don't know. We've never renovated this house since, since we got here. I had one of those shower mats that had like suction cups that wouldn't stay. Oh, funny thing. Okay, so I had like a rug. I got a rug that got super, super messy and like dirty and I put it in my shower because I think I, I think my, I might have spilled something on it or something. I don't remember exactly, but there was a shower like there's a rug, like a, a rug in my shower. And that was honestly a great feeling. Having a rug in your shower kind of good. I got a suction. My mom got a suction cup bath mat. And I hate how it feels under my feet. Get rid of it. Don't need it. Put, put a rug in your shower. I, it'll change your life forever. All you need to do is just wash it too. All you need to do is wash it and hang it to dry. And then you can put it right back. And you know what? If it's a shower, you can just hang it in the shower and it'll dry in the shower. Life hacks, guys. Life hacks. Something, uh, listen, there's something really nice about getting your toes between some fuzz and gripping that shit while you're taking a shower. Put those grippers away. <laughs> My life, man. My life. What am I doing with it? I'm showering with a rug, with a rug apparently. That's my life. I recommend you try it at least once in your life though, honestly. Good feeling. You guys think you could psychic damage me by doing carpeted bathroom? Hell no. I'm all for carpeted bathrooms. At least a rug in your shower, at least. At the very least, that's where I don't draw the line. Gosh, I got a shit ton of yogurt in my room. I have empty yogurt boxes, not boxes, what are those things called? Cups? I've emptied a bunch of empty yogurt cups in my room. I've gotten like a weird addiction with yogurt for some reason. And here's the thing. I'm lactose intolerant. That's right. What are you doing drinking lattes? It's soy milk. Don't worry about it. <clears throat> How'd you guys, did you guys check out your, your Twitch recaps, guys? Did you guys like your Twitch recaps?
The worst part about a bath. The worst part of a bath is the shower curtain. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm a care cool, cool, cool viewer. Um, so Jam Kisuke and Rosa was in my top 1%. So if you guys were in my top 1%, only guy I know in Gentle Ralts, I'm pretty sure you guys would be in the top 1%. Not gonna lie. I talked far too much in chats. No, that is good. That is good, only guy I know. Keep doing it. No, I'm not cool enough. Listen, you watch a bunch of other streamers too, so like, it's totally fine. Also, there was a period of time where, where like, we were on opposite schedules for when it comes to streaming, so I totally understand. shower curtain have you guys there are there are people who like take a bath with the shower curtain inside their bath while they're taking a bath and it's fucking it drives me insane there's nothing worse than running a just chatting stream with a dead chat i mean that'd be honestly a little bit embarrassing but like there's you know there are people that can do it imagine like like asmr basically asmr is basically a just chatting stream but like you have a very like unique way of doing it like where you just kind of talk and i don't know i think i want to do an asmr stream where i do it like this except i want to have 3d audio and whisper in your ears because i think that'd be pretty fun but in the meantime it's just me talking Life is just a just chatting stream with no viewers because I just talk to myself all day. You have you have cats to talk to. You have Hilda and Miss Honey now. See, that's what I'm more. It's, it's so funny. There are days where, like, when I had my days off and I had nothing to do, I would literally not use my voice until I started streaming. Like, I would wake up, I would like shower, I'd brush my teeth, I'd eat like all my meals, and then by the end of the day, where I start streaming. That was the first time I would talk all day. And honestly, I don't know how I feel about it. like that's so such a like a weird thing to think about. I don't know how I feel about it, guys. Like I'm thinking about I'm I'm thinking about it like right now. Not talking for a whole day. I'm just thinking like would I be comfortable just not talking like my entire life if, if no one was ever around would i be comfortable with just not using my voice it's kind of like it's kind of messing with me right now <laughs> it's messing with me so much if no one was around to talk to me would i talk because here's the thing remember where earlier when and when i said I'm okay with silence and I will literally just sit in the same room with somebody for like five minutes and like just be okay with silence. I'm thinking about that now and like if I'm in a room 24 hours, 24 hours in a room by myself, would I just not talk to anybody? Would I not talk to myself? My most watched channel was Ojaxer, but it's probably because I mainly stay up late in these the schedules kind of match. Oh, Jaxer is a great streamer, guys, by the way. If you guys have not, if you guys have not followed Ojaxer, by the way, um, Ojaxer was actually one of my um, top streams that I watched. So if you guys haven't followed Ojaxer, please. He's a funny dude. Um, he's not a VTuber, but he's got a lot of good energy. So <clears throat> Ojaxer actually caused my schedule to fuck up again. It's because I wasn't here. I'm so sorry. No. Um, so I went mute for like a year once. When I finally said something, my voice had changed so much I couldn't get used to it. That is kind of crazy, actually. That's nutty. Um, so, oh, 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 oh. One thing, one thing, guys. You guys remember earlier when I said, hey, I talked to that one dude. And he was a professional voiceover guy. Um, and, and for every streamer out there watching this right now. Um, here's some advice that he had to say, um, beginning, like a beginner, uh, beginner streamer, if you're just starting out or someone who's been streaming for years, this was actually some good advice to hear, even though I already kind of knew it, 
but like it was a good reminder to hear to hear from someone else you are going to hate your voice there are, there's are things about your voice that you're going to hate and it is so common for somebody to like listen to their voice on playback and be like Ugh, i hate that like i hate how that sounds i hate my voice i don't like i don't like how i sound. i hate my laugh i don't like this i don't like that that is going to be so freaking normal i don't hate my voice but i hate me listen <laughs> we'll get to that um so if the like the one thing you have to do is kind of like admit to yourself that is my voice there's no getting around it there's no changing it i mean you could change it you could change how you kind of whatever but for the most part when you're using your voice you don't think about using your voice right you don't think about how you sound like when you're talk when you're talking just like how often do you think about using your feet to walk you don't think about your feet you don't think about the shoes you're wearing you don't think about the socks you're wearing you just kind of have them right and all of a sudden when you start to use them in a way where you're supposed to think about them for example if you're a athlete and you're a track star guys i said feet once okay <laughs> i i mentioned feet because you don't really think about you i guess some people think about feet but don't think about feet in that sort of sense but your own feet okay not my feet not their feet your feet okay i think about my feet all day that's weird <laughs> okay hands okay think about your hands let's not think about our feet now let's think about hands how often do you think about using your hands you don't you just kind of use them right you pick things up you you carry things you use a knife to cook um you type with your hands you don't really think about using your hands you just kind of use them but the moment you have to be more detailed with things for example when you use a knife to cook like something that needs a bit more precision with cutting like i don't know you need to cut your meat a certain way or are you are you guys getting horny over hands now are you guys getting horny over wow okay there's no winning so i'm just gonna keep going um you, you use your hands like the moment you need to like be more meticulous with things is where you start to be more aware of your hands that's the, the thing with your voice once you start getting start using your voice in a way that you have to be, pay more attention to it for example if you have a podcast or you're a streamer or you're a voice actor that's when you start to notice more things about your your voice just like how you don't really notice things about your hands like maybe your fingertips are plumper than usual or maybe you have weird scars on your hands and you didn't really notice them until now or even the hand like the hand wrinkles that palm readers use like you don't really think about that but the moment you do you can start to kind of acknowledge the things about it and start using your hands in such a way and that you can start thinking about how to use it effectively and you can do that with your voice as well so the moment you realize that this is part of me my voice is part of me that's when you can be like okay well what are some minor things i can do to make it better not to completely change it but what can i do to make it better and things are like how you carry your voice how you speak your tone of voice your your tonality of going up and down and all around and and emoting how strong things come out how you can flex your throat and your and your throat muscles and your vocal cords that's when you kind of own it that's when you make it you it's going to be part of you you don't really have to like like it but the moment you own it and accept it and make it part of you make it you that's when you can get the best out of your voice and that's that's the advice he gave me honestly it didn't take that long because i kept talking about feet and hands but his his analogy was feet how often do you use your feet i got a pair of boots recently and at first wearing them made me feel taller even though the sole was just thick as another pair of boots the difference was that the newer boots were narrower so i felt that too mm. I have a pair of shoes that have like a, a wedge on the inside so it, it makes me physically taller but it makes me feel like i'm um like walking a downhill slope all the time but dang do I, my legs look freaking good when i'm taller 
holding a chef's knife with firm grippers. Can you imagine gripping a knife with your feet? Imagine, dude, there was a person who lost her arms in like an accident and she had to do everything with her feet. And she, there was a video of her making mac and cheese with her feet. It was so weird. Someone was totally into that. Was not me though. She was like a, a mother of two as well. So she like tucked in her kids into bed with her two feet. And she like cooked for them with her two feet. <laughs> Jam. Hi Thank you Akira, for the I missed you even though I saw you while you were in America. America. I hope you had a good time hanging out with me, even though it was kind of short. I'm sorry about the second time we were supposed to have a collab, but also I feel like we didn't even have the resources to do a collab properly. So <sighs> maybe it was for, maybe it was for the better, but hey, we'll have a collab. We'll have a collab soon. Wet shoes also change the posture of your legs. Heels were invented to make people's... Are you are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Heels were invented to make people's asses look better? They make my legs look better. Like my calves look like freaking like a persona character. I get the I get the the legs of a persona character once I do. They were designed. Hold on. I guess. Oh god, you're right. I was like thinking about where I, I wasn't actually standing, but I was thinking about it and like yeah, it it, it does. It kind of makes you lean. A certain way that your ass kind of sticks out <gasps> wow i thought it was just there to make your legs look better not your ass <gasps> i'm kind of like blown away now i'll just go to japan while you're there come visit me in japan i'm going to be a japan person nihon jin i'm not actually nihon jin but i'll be a person in japan <laughs> there's a joke about nihon jin like ni as in two, Hon as in a descriptor of legs, Jin as in a person. A two-legged person can be read as Nihon Jin. <laughs> Nihon Jin. Nihon go benkyo shimasu. Yoroshiku I'm gonna I'm gonna start studying Japanese a bit more seriously now. I did use Duolingo, but somebody somebody introduced me to the magical wonders of the Genki books, and I was like, you know what? I think I look I work better in self study. But the thing is, like, when you use the Genki books to study, it is technically still self study. Konnichiwa, minasan. Akira douche desu. Yoroshiku anagashimasu. I love my like, my like, impersonation of a Japanese person impersonating American. You know she cute. Onigashimas. Watashiwa. Canada Jin. Canada Sunday Mas. Yoshiku Onigashimas. Heel wedge shoes were made to change the posture of your legs. Hmm. Ah. Uh. I didn't. I just missed that. Heels were invented to make asses look better. That's why probably why the, my legs look better in those wedge shoes. By the way. I love how most country names are just the same. Well, <laughs> for the most part, until you're like, ah, oh, yes. Um, Canada, Canada. America, America, England, Igrisu, <laughs> Germany, Deutsche. <laughs> there was one. Uh, what was um? Uh, there was one that's used a lot in in Duolingo. Oh, hello, Krusty Mike again. We're back to Krusty Mike. There was one. There was one that is used a lot in in um in Duolingo, but I can't remember which one it is. Warsaw, 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 the Krusty Krab, SpongeBob. You guys see that one SpongeBob toy commercial for McDonald's where all the kids are going fucking crazy? They are just living for that McDonald's Spongebob toy. I think about that commercial at like once a month. 
You think that's how, like, VTuber consumers act around VTubers? They see the VTuber, they say, Oh, wow, they said the thing, and they start screaming at the top of their lungs. The Netherlands is Orando? Like, Holland? Because Holland. Orando. Orando. Orlando. Orlando Bloom. <laughs> Remember when Orlando Bloom was the, uh, the, the hottie of the year? Legolas? Mmm. What's his name? The guy from Pirates of the Caribbean? What, what character did he play in Pirates of the Caribbean? I don't even remember. I just know I have a jar of dirt. Deutz. Legless. I kind of like had like a weird, like I had a weird fascination with Legless. I wouldn't say it was necessarily a crush on Legless, but like I had a fascination with elves, I guess, because like they were known for like being good archers. And they're very dexterous and very sly and sleek. I just like, I like dexterous builds for characters. Like, like assassins, thieves, rogues, archers, things that require dexterity, um, fencers. But like, you know, I guess there's, there's coolness when it comes to like, um, like power builds like you know berserkers or orcs or you know it's not even a orcs aren't a class but you, you know <laughs> my nose is all stuffy right now um two-handed class pa paladins you know i started to open up the idea of of, of like heavy hitting power classes I think that all started when I started using um, Great Sword in Monster Hunter. Monster Hunter is a great game. We should all play it. I think in about now, in, in about 15 minutes here, we're gonna start playing a game. Cause I, I had a fun time chatting with you guys, but I also I wanna play some games with you guys. We'll start the poll in about five minutes. Schwing. Every time I think of Schwing, I think of like Zelda. And that comes from like the Legend of Awesome Schwing. Eagle Raptor Aaron Hansen. With questionable video game philosophy. Honestly. <sighs> I think of Wiener. Prismaya, you always think of Wiener. Doesn't matter, it doesn't matter if you're not thinking about Wiener, you're always thinking about Wiener. Swing your arms from side to side. Yeah, I don't get li Okay. Eagle Raptor Aaron Hansen. Aaron Eagle Raptor Hansen. His opinions on video games can be like questionable. <laughs> because in his like his philosophy is based on the way he plays video games, which is fair. Eagle Raptor hands. <laughs> um, like, some people don't like to spend the time reading. Some people don't like, you know, lore building. They just want to play a game. But some people like lore. They like reading. I'm not that person either, but like, I understand why... Why, why things need to be like time they need time to build up to build things up i have a funny feeling that eagle raptor hands and <laughs> um i have a, i have a weird feeling that he just does not like jrpgs i just like this weird feeling that he doesn't like i have a feeling he doesn't like final fantasy or like dragon quest or anything like that prismaya likes rpgs though Cause like his design philosophies for Ocarina of Time. If you guys watch the the sequelitis with Ocarina of Time, he like does not like Ocarina of Time. And like some of the stuff that he says is like it doesn't make sense. And 
bomb bowling. I could go for like days about bomb bowling, man. I his opinions on bomb bowling. I don't know. I feel like I feel like there's some sometimes there are times when gimmicks feel like they're gimmicky. But bomb bowling was not a gimmicky thing. I think it was a pretty fun thing to do. And you could like you could like put spin on like bombs when you threw them too. So like I don't know. I thought it was pretty cool. Some people did not. <laughs> I'm going to go to my fucking grave with bomb bowling. I'm going to put that on my fucking gravestone said bomb bowling wasn't actually that bad. Did they end up playing the remake of Skyward Sword? I feel like they did. I wonder if Aaron changed his opinion on that game after playing it. It's so Zelda goes through like these weird waves. I'm like, these Zelda games are not actually that good. But then they're like, oh, the next Zelda game comes out and they're like, well, actually it was pretty good. This new Zelda game just is not as good as the other one. <laughs> so we're perpetually going downhill, but like, not really. They did play the remake. Did he change his mind about it? Zelda fans, they're just, they don't really know what they want, honestly. I think that's the weirdest thing about anything, is that most people who consume something, they don't actually know what they want. I don't like Squidward Sword as much as, I, and I died. Did you, wait, did you play Squidward Sword? You know what you want? What do you want? What do you want, Prismaya? What do you want out of a Zelda game? I know that the, um, the remake fixed I know that the remake fixed a couple things, so like it wasn't completely bad. One of the things is like text boxes were sped up. <laughs> Zelda's the pro tag and she pegs Ganon. Listen, everyone wants that. There are rumors that like that are that uh, Zelda is gonna be playable in the new. Will you stop being fuzzy over there? Yeah. There's rumors that um Zelda is gonna be um out playable or like. In the new, in the new Zelda. I, God damn, this fuzziness is going to kill me. You can play as her in the Hyrule Warrior. Yeah, and you could peg Ganon. Everyone loved it. The standard complaint parts was like the parts with the flooded forest and the escort missions on the volcano. Okay, yeah. There's nothing you can really do about that. Yeah. But that was not a fun part. I'll, I'll agree with that, though. I will agree. The The desert area is where I think is like the most unique part. It's the one that stands out the most in my mind, as well as that one water area, the water temple. That was a beautiful place. Man, I should I should play that. I really want to play that now. Okay. Uh, do you guys want to start a poll? We'll start a poll, guys. Okay, what kind of games do you guys want to play? What should we play today? What shall we play today? Mario Kart 8. Um, we got Splatoon 3, Salmon Run. Um, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Um, we could do like Overwatch 2 slash any fps games um what is some what is some guy I, I'm, I'm looking for one more game one more game that we could play as a as a community we could do <laughs> we could do jackbox but jackbox is um it's very um iffy on on twitch pokemon i want something a little bit more engaging that isn't just us doing our own things 
I guess we could do, yeah, we could do Pokemon Raids. We can do Pokemon Scarlet Violet Raids. We'll go for five minutes. I'm engaged in Pokemon? What, to Larry? <laughs> like everybody else? Carbon Roller Tri-Stringer. Oh, I do love the, the Tri-Stringer. The Squeezer. I did mention Monster Hunter. I did mention Monster Hunter. It's too late now. I kind of made the pull already. I kind of I kind of want to get rid of Overwatch 2 in that and just replace that with Monster Hunter. I don't have I don't have the recent the the Sunrise DLC, so I don't know. I only mentioned Pokémon cuz I'm already playing it. That's fair. Hey, how many Switch games do you guys want to play? All these available on Switch except for any first person play. I guess we could play Fortnite on Switch. I remember when Fortnite came out on Switch, it was like so bad. It was garbo garbo garbage. I was not a fan. Not a fan. Although Fortnite is a fun game, honestly, not gonna lie. Okay, I was I was kind of hesitant to say that Fortnite is the ultimate crossover game because I was like, uh, I don't know how I feel about that comp that statement, but I'm growing up to that statement now because they did add a whole bunch of characters. It's not even just video game characters. It's like it's like movie characters, it's video game characters, it's TV characters. You know, it is the ultimate crossover game now. And I was like, yeah, maybe Smash Bros, but no. I rescind that and say that yes, Fortnite is the ultimate crossover game now. The one thing that is kind of like, uh, about it for me to admit that is that like, every character plays the same though. If characters played a little bit differently, I'd be like, abso fucking lootly, but no. Um, everyone pretty much plays the same. It's just skins. It's just skins. I'm torn between Mario Kart and Splat, even though I don't have Mario Kart myself. Mario Kart is fun. The new the new uh, tracks came out. I played almost all of them. I think I missed out on two of them. While I was played while I was uh, in in Chicago with some friends. <laughs> I played all of them, they're all right. I think the one that stood out in my mind the most, I think, was the the remake of the, the Peaches Courtyard one. The Christmas track was way too short. I don't remember. I played, I ended up playing that one twice. I like the theming of it, that's for sure. Oh, the the tree one, the, the remake of the, of the tree one from Mario Kart Wii. I think that one was really fun. Oh! The 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 train one from Mario Kart 64, that one threw me off because they made the train track part of the course. Cause normally like you just go through the same areas, but they, they made the train track part of it. And I was like, whoa, I got throw I got so thrown off. I was like, I don't understand what just happened. I thought that was really cool. I kinda want another like F Zero esque map though i wonder if they're gonna add i wonder if they're gonna add like external characters again you know or like what if they add like another donkey kong stage i guess donkey kong is part of the mario universe but like hmm. what if there was like a fire <laughs> what if byleth was playable i guess it wouldn't be byleth it would be the other fire emblem character the fucking toothpaste character what if toothpaste was playable in mario kart I did not get to play Big Run. I missed it. I was, um, I was unable to. Um, I think I was still in Canada. No, I know I wasn't. I was definitely in, I was definitely in America, but I was staying with somebody who had like iffy internet connection. So I wasn't able to play a whole bunch of online games. In fact, I spent most of my time hanging out with them anyways. So like, it was okay. I would rather spend time with them than play Big Run. The third lap. Yeah, that's the one. That's what kind of threw me off. I love when they're like totally just throwing 
random things at you in the in the maps that you're familiar with it just kind of throws you for a loop and you're like whoa they're doing a really good job at that they're like a really good job at that all right poll is ending and what did we decide on what did we decide on splatoon three salmon run okay we're playing some salmon run today guys all right let me uh let me change into something a little bit more comfortable and we will all continue onward with some salmon run no pogey no no unfortunately not but hey i should have added like extra voting but no it's fine salmon run I'm gonna wrap my Splatoon copy as a Christmas gift and I don't want to open it yet. Also, I'm bad. That's valid. That's valid. Okay. I'll be right back. And I'll change into something uh, cozier. And uh, we'll be on our way. Okay, okay, okay. switch on Oop, that my oh my TV is completely on the volume is so loud so let's turn that down we could have played something like Mario Superstars but like <laughs> that only like sticks for like a certain amount of people and it's not like it's not very not very inclusive, honestly. It's very exclusive. It's exclusive party. All right. Wow. Here we are at SeaWorld. <laughs> I lurk while I pogey alone. The only thing I really need to do with Pokemon is just finish my Pokedex. And I guess I could, like, shiny grind. It's been so long since i played this. Sebastian, hello, welcome, welcome. I guess I should probably change my information now, shall I? Ba -ba -ba. Splatoon 3. Here we go. A new season! I haven't even booted up. <laughs> I haven't even booted it up. My first time seeing a VTuber? Wow. I broke your VTuber virginity. How does it feel? Shiny hunting is easy in uh, Scarlet Violet. I, so I've heard. I remember there's like a way to like completely like to make it like Pokemon like fly out of the walls. I don't care about this anymore. I just want to play the video game. Huh? Huh? I haven't found a sh I found two shinies. I found one shiny in the wild and I hatched a, a random sand dial because I wanted to see how eggs work. And the one time I'm like... I want to see how shinies work, or how eggs work, and I fucking hatch a shiny. <laughs> it's Whooper Wednesday! Are you guys ready for Whooper Wednesday? What is this game? This is Splatoon 3. A very cool Nintendo shooty game that is totally appropriate for all ages. Have you guys seen Gentle Ralts' um, art? Gentle Ralts does art in this game, and it's really nice. What is Nintendo? Uh, it's a cool thing. It's a video game. It is a video game. Match menu, okay. Um, how do I play with friends? Okay, there we go. Freelance with friends. Okay. Um, I have to add you guys, right? Do 
If you guys want to play with me, I think you have to add me. There's no, like, room code jo joining. Which is kind of sad, honestly. Um, I think maybe switch code is, is still on here. I think. Hold on. Let me see. There we go. Okay, I'm going to do my own for now. I'll do one by myself, and when you guys are ready, you guys can um, hop right in. Just uh, let me know. I was actually watching someone do big run, which kind of made me want to do some, some salmon run. Specifically salmon run, not turf war. I'm a professional. Is it finding a match for me? <laughs> I'm pro fresh uh, plus two. I don't mind. Um, it's more on you. Because I think the lowest rank decides how much you get, so... I think, is that, or is it, is it average? I have to press A again? Oh, oh. I had to wait for a plus one, at least, minimum. Okay, we'll do one set, and then anyone who wants to play, get your games ready. And we'll all be playing. Where, 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 Prismaya, quit messaging me. I can see them. Oh, I fucking missed. I got the 12 bonuses for this rotation. Oh. Wow, you are really on this, huh? Are you going to be doing turf war later? I don't think so. Is my a cool streamer? What I say? I'm seeing my notifications on my phone that I cannot use. <laughs> oh, I love this map. <gasps> we have Yon Binary. Yon Binary's on our team. Yeah! Make way! Splatoon is so fun, guys. How do people just not enjoy this game? Don't worry, thing person! Who is that person? I can't even read their name. I gotta get collect some eggs, that's what I gotta do. Wait. Oh. <laughs> ah! Someone died, hold on. I got you. Did I just kill some- I just killed something. What the fuck? Wait, hold on a second. Is someone dead? Oh, someone's dead. I got my Booyah Bomb. Oh fuck, we need so much. We made the quota though. Oh my god! Booyah! I 
I feel like Splatoon is one of those games where you can always just kind of come back to. The squeezer. Kind of sounds like Weezer. How do you guys feel about Weezer, the band? I only like two of their songs, I think. <laughs> I've only really listened to Weezer only a little bit. Carl Weezer? <laughs> how do you feel about Carl? Okay, question. How do you feel about Carl Weezer? Fuck. Ugh, I can't reach. Jimmy, your mom is so hot. Got to revive Neon Binary. Okay. Neon Binary, come here. There you go. Ah! Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, it seems like I am out of my element because I've been so, it's been so long. This is not good. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh my goodness, holy shit, we just made it. Holy my god, oh my lord. Try stringer, okay. Okay, you can always come back to it. I wouldn't say you come back good, but you could always come back to it. the final wave I totally forgot let's go let's get that stupid fry guy fly fly fry fly fry fly guy he's over there I'm gonna take care of him get the fuck <gasps> did it just really do that did it really just do that? Okay, that thing's dead now. Oh, that's the wrong button. What's the... Oh, I don't have... <gasps> Wait, where'd my super go? Is my super gone? Okay, we met quote anyways, so. Survive, Metal Gear survive! Is that game actually good? I don't know. I've heard bad things about Metal Gear survive, but like only because those are from the haters, so I don't really know. We did it! Like, we just barely made it. <laughs> These weapons are kind of hard to, to use, I'm not gonna lie. Kitty pack and yawn binary. Oh, check it out. Oh, check. Oh, so close. I almost got a helmet. Again, right? Oh, it matches me again. Hold on a second. How do I... How do I not match? Oh, I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up. I fucked up. Exit game.
shit, that works right. I, I panicked, okay? I panicked. This is how I can fix it. By panicking. <laughs> I want to off the hook so badly. I want off the hook to have their DLC now. I am an off the hook... Uh, inappropriate word. Professional plus three. Come on in, everybody. We're gonna fr fry some shrimp. I'm gonna change my uh, some of my information. Um, switch. Join in. Switch. Yeah, cool. <laughs> Michael. Oh my God, we got the Michael. I believe in you, Michael. That's a low fire rate. Can this thing destroy things though? Does this thing act as like a grenade? Getting this. Okay, we got a bunch of guys down. He's good. Is the, is the Luna Blaster able to kill the fly guys? The the missile guys? Or do I still have to use bombs on those guys? Hello. Michael! Michael! I believe in you, Michael! Oh god, who is that? Hello! I joined for the next round. Did the did the uh did the teasing of the game, the urge. Every time I see somebody play a game, I'm like, oh, I want to play that too. The urge always gets me. <gasps> this is the squeezer, right? Squeezer. Carl Weezer. I'm not a fan of what's going on here. Ooh. Michael, go Michael. I love you, Michael. There's a eel guy behind me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Michael! 
Michael, help! Michael! Oh god. <laughs> The stick. There's so much going on right now. Am I even safe up here? I don't even know. This is only wave two, baby. Try stringer baby. I love this weapon so much. Uh oh, low tide? Or high tide? Low tide. We got this guys. Ooh. Mm. Bring it up the rear. Let's go, Suki. Let's go, Suki. Bring it up the rear. I'm helping. Damn. Oh, hello. Come on, Michael. Booyah. need to do any of that. Honestly, that was an easy round three. Wave three, I mean. Thank you, Michael. Ooh, beautiful Michael. Lovely Maiko. Hey, we got a full team. Let's go, guys. Let's do this. Whoa, did you see that? I hit all three. Ooh. That's professional right there. So we have a plus two, we have a plus three. Uh oh. I think we might be in trouble, guys. I can't we can just see the helicopter flying around up top. Get out of here. <laughs> uh oh. We lost Suki already. Brrm. 
Brim. Oh, we got a laser guy. Oh, no one killed this guy yet? Hold on, let's kill him. Let's get him. Wait, what? What just happened? Oh my god. Oh, you guys weren't kidding. <laughs> you guys weren't kidding. We just need one more. We just need one more. One more. One more. <laughs> How the hell? How? Wow. We all... Wow. <laughs> I'm speechless, guys. Absolutely speechless. It's not anything that we didn't do, too. Like, it was a heavier. Tempted to change my title. What is your title even? Oh, fuck. <laughs> I need to ready up. Can you even change it from here? I guess not. We will wait for you. Octoling. The rare Octoling. It looks like I have a little mustache. That's my favorite thing about the Octoling. Slippery Dog? I don't even know what my title is right now. I know my, uh, my title in Wii Sports. Oh, hello. Wait, can I see my- Ah, oh, shoot, that's not the one I wanted. Okay. Match menu. No, no, no. What is it? How do I check my title again? Can I do it from here? My title is currently fully automatic therapist. An automatic therapist. Something that we all need, honestly. I'm like super into the uh, idea that therapy should be free. Could you imagine if we all had free therapy? How mentally stable the world could be? Oh shoot, you know what I have to do? I have to schedule a karaoke stream <laughs> for next week. Processed dog. Oh my god, you're a processed dog. I don't know how I feel about doing like a Christmas themed karaoke. Honestly, I did it last year and honestly, I don't really like Christmas songs. I don't even really like Christmas songs. Oh my god, Emerald. Oh, let's get rid of you. Let's get rid of that, the laser guy. Laser.
Oh, this is not good. This is not good. I have a crab tank, guys. Don't worry. I got a crab tank. Okay, we got... Okay, I got the laser guy, or the, the missile guy. I got the missiles. I got the eel! I got the eel. Emerald, you're alive. Emerald, you're alive. I can't climb the... I can't climb the... <laughs> I just need to live. I just need to live. I just need to live. Okay, I'm living, guys. Live and learn. Sonic Adventure 2. <laughs> a living teammate is... Oh, my God. A living teammate is better than a dead teammate. That's all I remember. That's all that's important. I have a bad feeling about this, by the way. Little mud mounds. Hey! We got them all? Cool. I don't like these guys. Oh, get out of here. I want to do another tank. Feed him. He's hungry. Ink. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, we're good here. We're good. We're good. We're good. Emerald, you're alive. All right. Little squeegee. We got a little squeegee, eh? Okay. Oh. Nice. Nice, nice. Don't worry, I'll get the eel. I got the eel! Uh oh, eel two. <gasps> we got eel two now. Oh, small flies. Hello. Okay, got this one. Got this one. Mm. Oh my lord. Okay. Did I miss? Oh, I fucking missed. Okay. Got him. Okay, someone's down. I can fix this. Okay. Oh, fuck. Stingray. I'll take care of the stingray. Okay, got him. I got him. You guys are doing great. <gasps> yes! 
Yes! Quab. Oh, wait. Hold on a second. Hold on a fuck. Kazunai. I was not expecting this. I got the Luna Blaster. I hear this is good. I hear this is good. This is good damage, right? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Did I do a lot of damage? I've only beaten the keys in the eye once before. What the fuck is this? Okay. Try to live. Oh. Growing jokes. Oh, that's my growing jokester. No silver scales. We suck, guys. At least we got some levels. Got it. I didn't even- I wasn't even ready for that, honestly. I was not even ready. Time to go to work. Wait, we have Slippery Dog and Process Dog? How do we even get Dog? How do we get the Dog title? It is offensive that I do not have the Dog title. This one. No? Oh, it's that one. I still don't know how this one works, honestly. know which one to get. Is it the one that's glowing the least? Oh, he died! Nice. That's we we love to see it. One that glows the most. See, I thought there was ones that glue the most, but like, I couldn't find them. <laughs> if the gusher is higher, you're closer. Oh, okay. Uh oh, high tide! Emerald! <laughs> I don't like that sound. Brum, 
Oh shit, okay. Oh, I got Reef Slider. Yes! That was an excellent use of the Reef Slider. Just, we gotta be alive, guys. Just alive. Let's live! Oh, use the call button. I never thought about using that. Damn. <coughs> oh, so close, so close. Wham. Wham. Oh, I like this color. I like that color. That's a nice color. I like that boulder. That's a nice boulder. Do we get that color this time around? We don't. We have Pepto Bismol. It's not even ne necessarily Pepto Bismol. It's like, what color? What, what would you describe this color? Pink. <laughs> Pink. Your life, your motherfucking life ends 30 seconds from now. <sighs> These dang small fries? I'm not a fan of them. These guys too. Not a fan of them either. Oh, this guy almost ran off with three of them. Eel. Eel. Oh, this guy brought him right to me. Right to me. Got him. Oh my god, all those eels! You got a feel for the eels, guys? A feel for the eels. Do your job! Uh oh, let's get rid of him. Got him. Okay, I've got missile strikes, so that's good. Ooh. Fish stick! Let's get rid of this.
Okay, got it. We got it. Is there another donk guy? Emerald, I got you. Emerald, I got you. Emerald, I don't got you. Emerald, I got you. <laughs> okay, that kind of failed. What? Whoa! What the hell? Okay, I'm just gonna do this again. What the hell? We gotta get them in there right now. Gotta get them in there. Yes! We're doing it. We're doing it, guys. We're doing it 100%. 100%. We're doing it 100%. 100% Splatoon. I kind of want fish sticks now. I, I'm really craving deep fried fish. I'm heavily craving it now. Oh, hello, little f mall friends. <laughs> little guys. Okay, I'm out of supers, so I cannot help anymore. At least when it comes to supers. Someone's dead. I gotta help you guys. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, you're alive again. Don't matter. All these things, all these fries. Someone get rid of that. I'm not having a fan of that. I'm not a fan of that. Uh, I'm sweaty. Oh, I'm sweaty. Oh, fucking rebounded off. Okay, we gotta survive. Just Metal Gear survive. We just have to Metal Gear survive. Get up, Suki! You're alive! <laughs> Metal Gear Survive. Oh, my face. So, like, th is that the ocean that we're, like, fighting around? Is that the ocean? The goo? Did we turn the ocean into goo? Oh, shit. I'm so close to leveling up. <gasps> Golden boy. I'm gonna guess that the waters, the, the ocean waters are so polluted because of mankind. That's what I'm gonna take out of it. There's so much toxic waste in the ocean that the entire ocean is toxic waste. I still don't have the dab. I still can't hit the dab. Really? Here we go. Emerald, I, I saw that! Oh, let's get rid of that splatterfly thing. Oh, let's get rid of that. I'm not a fan of it. Oh my god, Emerald. Emerald. 
both of our attempts were thwarted by a bunch of small guys. Okay, I got him though. I got him. Oh, I missed. There we go. Oh my goodness. This thing is still here? Get out of here, you. There you go. Oh. <laughs> huh. Wait, was the dab a limited time thing? Limited time offer? Seasonal? Ninety nine in the first catalog. Oh, damn. I remember people having the dab like within the first week. How the hell? Whatever. Dabbing's overrated, okay? This is how I cope. So the, I know the, the missile launcher guy, there's a thing to him, like, he, like, the, the left, the left one aims for everyone, I think, or something like that, fuck, and then the right one aims for everybody, something like that, Emerald, I'm here to help. There's someone behind me, I'm so scared. I'm so scared, okay. We got him. Splatoon. Let's get him. <laughs> get up! Get up! <laughs> I said the aims for everybody. Twice. Uh, I meant like one of them aims for one person in particular and the other one aims for everybody. <laughs> That's what I meant. Listen, my brain does not work under pressure. So do not put pressure on my brain. If you push on it, it goes squeaky, squeaky. I got a squeaky brain. It's soft, it's gushy. I got a wet and gushy brain. Oh my god, that eel's protecting the other eel! Uh-oh. Let's do that. God. Okay. Let's keep going. We we can live. Oh, I'm gonna. Uh, my focus is on living, guys. I don't care. We are going to live. We are going to live. Living is our goal. <sighs> huh. 
If you dodge roll at the right time, you can live through steelhead bombs. Oof. All the competitive strats. Is there like is there like a competitive salmon run? There's got to be like competitive salmon run. Plus one, guys. What's the highest that you can get in this? Wow. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, I can do the gotcha. Hold on, I should do the gotcha real quick. That's not the one. <laughs> Executive 999. It's not a game. A logical worker. Hashtag. A worker. A logical worker. Winter loving worker. Winter loving you. I gotta I gotta do Joker. Jokester. Old fashioned jokester. <laughs> nine squids, nine octopi, nine salmons. Man, what a weird... Okay, the, here's the thing about that game. I never want to come back to that game. 999. But it left such an impression on me. I think the tediousness of it, of getting all the endings, makes me not want to play it over again. And I think that's literally the only reason. Just that reason alone. The puzzles in it were really fun, though. I do like the puzzles. Things are only going to get harder from here, huh? That's me. It's my car. It goes. I'm laughing too hard. I can't. You changed your species? How dare you? Are you an inkling now or an octoling? Can't, I, I think you're an inkling? <laughs> I didn't see. Oh, you're an octoling now. I kind of want to switch to inkling, honestly. Inklings are pretty cool. They're in Super Smash Brothers. I'm surprised octolings are not in Super Smash Brothers. Are you kidding me? Hey, did you just... Oh shit, okay. Skip it a bit of them. Skip it a bit of them. I fucked up. I fucked up.
Whoa, did you did you see that, guys? <gasps> that was so cool. I did something really cool, though. That's an eel. That is an eel. What do I have? A reef slider? Okay, that's good to know. Good to know. Man, we're doing so good, guys. We are prof professionals. <laughs> infinite dog. I mean, that's my dog. My dog is infinite dog. He exists everywhere and everywhere. Anywhere and everywhere and everywhere and anywhere and anywhere and everywhere and everywhere and not. I think I got like a... I got one of the salmonids, the boss salmonids, to be crushed by the, uh, the UFO guy. Nothing really crazy, but... Enough to be like, whoa. Everyone had it with that, <laughs> that Jaws. That Maws? Is it Maws or Jaws? I think it's Maws. Okay, um, I'm gonna survive real quick. Things are not going really well here. Uh huh. Sticking. I survived! I thought it'd be funny. Oh, there's a there's a ray guy, a stingray. Get out of here, you. Okay. I'm going to get that the fly fish. I think it's fly fish. It's got to be fly fish. You. Okay, I got one. Oh, it rebounded. Okay, I can I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. I can help. I can help. Get him. That isn't- holy shit, that is an eel. <laughs> Wait, I got spotted by the fly fish. Oh my. At least it was on the third round. <sighs> yeah, I don't know what happened there. <clears throat> Probably it's because I was going after this, the, the, the stingray. <laughs> with a roller. That was not very efficient of me. 
Emerald. At least we didn't lose anything. But we didn't gain anything either. Truly sad. Well, well. <clears throat> the first booyah bomb I sent off stuck onto the weather ball. <laughs> Slippery dog, infinite dog. Oh, you guys are dogs. I should be calling you my Dolce dogs instead of my Dolce dudes. Got him. like those guys. They're really nice to like launch the eggs, but like man. Ooh. Let's get rid of this guy. <laughs> oh my god, we all th <laughs> we all fucking <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see that? Did you see that? <sighs> I, was, I, was, I was this close! I was this close! <sighs> At least I got it. How much salmon I could run? <laughs> Your Konosuba meter? Wait. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention to my Kono. My, my Kizuna. Salmon run. <sighs> salmon run is an experience. Yes! Got him. We love to see it. What? <laughs> How annoying. Oh my god. Okay. There's all these eggs here, but I can't even get 
them to move. Suki, I'll get ya! It's only one second left, but I'll get ya! I got gotcha. you. Booyah. Oh, low tide. I think this is our first low tide, like actual low tide. The other one was like kinda didn't count because it was like the boxes. Let's get him! Oh, let's get him! Nice! Okay, let's get this guy. Uh oh. Oh god. That could have been dangerous. Get up! Three more. Three more. Got it. Get up. Get up. Whew. Oh yeah. Last wave, guys. We got this. We got this. Where are we dropping, boys? The red tune. <laughs> this lime colored ink is making me want. Ah! Oh, fuck. Ah, God. Let me in. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. This lime colored ink is making me want lime on fish. Ugh. Fish with lime? Oh, it's so good. I recommend it. Okay, I'm not doing very well with this thing right now. I keep... Okay. I keep pressing the wrong button when it comes to my ult. Okay, we got this. We got this. This is easy. Easy, easy, easy. Easy one more. We got it. Just survive. Make it like Metal Gear and survive. <sighs> wow, wow, wow. It's yellow? It's like lime green. See, I keep... That's not good. Okay. Got it. Well, 
Where's the Salmon King? Where'd he go? There he is. Oh, are you kidding me? I missed. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Suki, you're up. Suki, you're up. Get up. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> I'm just gonna Metal Gear survive right now, okay? can't even get to you guys. Get up. <sighs> Metal Gear survive. Only one silver scale. I used to think those were like jello molds. They look like jello molds to me. We got a we got a five bronze jello molds. The ink is highlighter yellow. Okay, okay, I'll I'll agree with that. But it it makes me want. It makes me want some fish okay yeah okay yeah it looks a lot more yellow in here but it makes me want fucking fish with lemon or lime citrus lime citrus fruit this rotation is not good for coho because it's low damage stuff <sighs> c'est la vie Cest la vis. Oh, fuck, a tornado? Hold on a second. Was that tornado always there? Doing solid, we're doing a solid amount. Oh, someone's down. Ralts, Ralts, Ralts. There we go. Damn, 30? Damn, 30? Damn, that one's like a freebie. That one's not too hard at all. There's like no boss simonids. Low tide? Low tide! Why did I dodge roll into it? <laughs> you guys saw that. Fuck. I'm out.
I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh! Professional! I keep wasting my alt charges. <laughs> So I'm gonna get you up, Ralts. Just kidding, somebody else did. Oh no, I did. Oh my god, okay. Yes. 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 Yes! Metal Gear survive, guys! No! Oh, we were two seconds away! <laughs> oh my god. That was so close, guys. Hontoni. <laughs> One second, I know. <sighs> okay. Um, I'm, I've only got a couple more left in me, guys. And then I think I'm, I'm good for tonight. I'm gonna see who is live right now, just so I can see who I can raid into. <laughs> Let's see, oh, Jaxer's live? Okay. Thank you, Suki, for joining. I appreciate it. It was fun playing with you. So Jaxer's live, but he's playing Mass Effect, which is not something I want to really, really get into. Oh, Jaxer's a great streamer, but not really split tune adjacent. Hmm. I think I know who I want to raid today. I definitely know who I want to raid today. Wormle! Wait, who's our teammate? <gasps> Miss Saturn? <gasps> it's Prismaya's mom! Goodbye. We all went for the left one! Did we really just fucking do that, guys? <laughs> we all just fucking stood there. <laughs> Prismaya, your mom's here. Miss Saturn. Unless that's you. Would you be Miss Saturn because you're Mr. Saturn's daughter? Oh, fuck. Where did Miss Saturn go? Oh, she just disappeared. Right in front of my eyes. I don't like the slowdown they cause. Okay, we met the quota. <laughs> Miss new pussy. I found you, Miss new booty. Do you guys remember that song? I found you, Miss new booty. 
get it together and bring it back to me. What song? What song is that? What's the What's the actual song's name? Is it Miss New Booty? Is it Is it Is it just Miss New Booty? I no no no! I didn't make that song up. There's a song called Miss New Booty or something. It was I found you, Miss New Booty. Get it together and bring it back to me. Oh, I just faked that eel out. Did you see that? He thought he was gonna get me. Got him. Guy's mine. Gotcha. This is called Miss New Booty. <laughs> the classic crisp. Oh my god, I almost ran into the, into the liquid. Miss New Booty. Oh, I don't like... I don't like High Tide. I love the song High Tide by Muna. Muna Hoshinova. You're pulling me in like gravity. Let's just, uh, let's just do this real quick. Generals, how did you die? Let's, uh, let's do this. Let's do that. Shit. Oh, that freaking fly. Okay, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna survive. Metal Gear. This is a lot. No! The eel! Wow. I found you. This new booty. Get it together. Bring it back to me. Bound you, Miss New Booty. Man, I want some ramen so badly right now. I died by cut touching the car. You touch my car, you die. That salmon, like you touch my car, you die. <laughs> Truck. You touch my truck. Okay, this is gonna be my last one, guys. Last one, and then I'm, I'm good for tonight. Just hit VP. <gasps> wow. A vice president. Vice president of Salmons. Miss Saturn's back.
I'm pulling you in like gravity. Oh. Good job, everybody. Got him. A lot of them. Okay. Oh, the chum. Focus on this guy here. Got him. Fuck, gotta move. Okay, quota. Those are missiles coming at us. Oh shit. Oh my goodness, that was close, guys. Mm. Sandwich. I'm craving sandwich. Also, fuck. I just shifted my eye contact. Hold on. <laughs> okay, I'm good now. That could have been dangerous. Chum. Me and Emerald. Ooh. Oh god. Oh god. It's not even wave three yet. It's not even wave three. There we go. Okay. Fuck it. I gotta go. I'm gonna take care of that stinger. Oh, there's so many bosses! Oh my god! We really just got hit with everything all at once. <laughs> that fly fish, holy shit. Aw, <laughs> oh, pay cut. Okay, one more. Okay, one more. The rule is one good one. One, one more. That wasn't good. One more. <laughs> I wish the weapons did a little bit more damage, just like a little bit more. It takes. It seems like it takes forever to take things down. That was like five different like boss salmonids too. There was like a, one of those shot launcher ones. There was the eel, there was the, the fly fish. I think there was like the car too was there. I don't know. I could be mistaken, but there was a heck of a lot going on right there. Oh, it's fucking low tide. Haha. <laughs> 
It's pulling you in like gravity. I need to get close to that fly fish though. It's so hard to get close to that fly fish. Okay, you want? Fuck it. Grenade. I'm right behind you, Emerald. I'm right behind you. I have no ink. No! <sighs> that was, wait, that was wave one. Dude, I love, I love the blasters. Blasters are so fun. So there, so then I started blasting. Wait, where, why'd that not go through? <laughs> Sailor, hello, welcome, oh, hello. Get up, Emerald. Get up, Samurai. Ugh. Oh, there's a fly fish. There's a fly fish. Are you kidding me? It bounced out. It bounced out. It's been forever since I've seen you on. It's because I was on vacation. And then I was also struggling with real real life stuff, so that was kind of shitty. Get up, samurai. Oh god. Stay. Yes, yes. Now it is time for Akira to be a full-time streamer. Prepare yourself. I'm gonna be branding myself like crazy. You're really, wow, I love your brand. Thank you. My brand. My special eyes. You may look with your special eyes and look at my brand. Really? Get up, Samurai! Now's the time. Ow. 
Emerald! I can't. Metal Gear Survive. Metal Gear Survive. <laughs> yeah. Every time I think about branding, I think about like branding a cow. Like you know when you like take the the, the heated thing, you'll and you and you sizzle their flesh. Seems kind of rude, honestly. You got a future here, kid. Do we have a future here? I do not want a future at this company. 60 out of 99. That's almost 69. <sighs> okay. Alright guys, thank you for playing. It was fun. How do I leave? How do I leave? There we go. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Pro Fresh One. Not bad. Oh, fuck. <laughs> All right. I guess that's the end of the stream, guys. Thank you for joining. All right. I'm going to send you guys off, but hey, but first... But first, hey, check me out on all these places. You can uh, join, my, uh, join my Discord, get notifications whenever I go live, and talk to everybody else who wants to talk to me, as well as the other people who want to talk to you. I got a YouTube channel, I got a VOD archive, and a highlights channel, so check both of those out, as well as my Twitter. And if you aren't following me on Twitch already, hey, follow me on Twitch. Um, I also have a TikTok too that's not like listed on there, and a new Tumblr. I should probably add those to that to that uh, hotkey. And um, yeah, we're gonna be raiding. We're gonna be raiding Kazooie. Um, they are currently playing Tomodachi Life. I want to raid them because they're playing a Nintendo game, and that's literally the only other reason why. Hey, our raid messages are you winning, son? You can use whatever emote you want to use. I just like to use these ones here. Um, it could be whatever you want, but yeah. Um, I'm hoping to stream a lot more. Keep an eye on my schedule on Twitch. Hey, did you know that you can click... Um, you can click on schedule and then click anything on there and then you can get a reminder for any of my streams I'm gonna hopefully be using that a lot more as well as using my discord to uh, schedule streams as well and You guys can keep up with me on Twitter as well for stream notifications So I don't know what time it is for you guys. I just hope it's a good time. Have a good everybody. Have a good <laughs>